guys, it's me. Guess what came in today? Solid state drive in this package. Oh, so we gotta open this now. New egg. Shit, I gotta clean my desk off. Note server locked up again, so I don't know what the hell's wrong with it. I'm probably going to have to fucking... I, I think it may be the power supply and it may be going out. Because it was going... Uh, uh, so, I don't know. I mean, like I said, I think the power supply is going out in it. Uh, Hold on just a minute. I'm back. Okay, dokie. So we are going to pull this out. And here we go. Damn, this thing's light. I've never physically seen one of these things before, so... Oh, let's put it in. Ugh. Oh shit, I got the wrong screwdriver. We're going to do side-by-side -side comparison. Oh, shit, I need a different screwdriver. This ain't going to work. Oh, okie dokie. This is a traditional hard disk. This one's dead, though, as you've seen in the previous video. It blue screened on me when I tried to format it. I don't need that. Okie dokie. Damn, this thing is small. Oh, okay. I'm discharged. Damn it. I had to use the most stickiest sticker they could find. Damn, this thing is small. Okay. What we have here, on the left-hand side, we have a traditional hard, uh, hard disk. And on the right-hand side, we have the SanDisk Ultra Plus Solid State Drive. This one is dead. This one's replacing the dead one. I 
and as you can see it still has the same mounting holes as the traditional hard drive has so the Zeta ports are still the same size in the same spot so that's good there This one came with a spacer though for laptops because it's a notebook drive. So now we're going to be putting this in this notebook now.